the first app I'm going to talk through today is a dictionary application. This one is Russian English by Ultralingua, one of our development partners. So you can see it has all the basic dictionary functionality, but some unique things this one has is uh, continuous scrolling. So it has more of a book experience, more of a, a browsing experience as well. One of the great things you can do with this is access conjugations. And the table instantly updates. Uh, you can get through the alphabet quickly by just clicking on a single letter. And then scrolling again. You can also switch the, uh, the language by pressing that. And so now you'll be navigating in Russian with a Russian interface into English. Another great thing about this application is you can instantly look up numbers. So with this keypad, you can type in any number and have the number instantly translated into the, uh, the language you're translating into. OK. So the next application I'm going to show is uh, something from our partner called Viscuit, which is a children's an animated dictionary application. Now this is just an activity app which features um, some of our children's dictionary content um, and turn into fun games for kids of um, pretty early ages, I'd say from three to five mostly. So you have a number of activities that you can do. So you can paint. Then once you're done with your masterpiece, you can save it to the iPad's um, internal native photo gallery. You can also look through a variety of thematic spreads, and which acts like a picture book. Zebra. Elephant. Then we have just a database of images. You can navigate by either the alphabet or by themes. So let's look at themes for the moment. And if you tap on the, the hat of the magician, you can pull up the menu wherever you are in the application. So let's take a look at animals. So here you can scroll through a picture deck featuring all your favorite animals. Dolphin. Dolphin. If you'd like to change the input language, you can choose either UK English or US English. And that gives you a feeling for that app. Now this is a, um, a, a perfect app for traveling. This is our iPhrase book with our partner in car. So the great thing about this app is you can choose your, your target language and your input language. So let's choose English um, as our language and let's look at let's look at Jack, let's look at German. So we can um, take a look at common phrases that'll help you traveling when you're in Germany. You can also search for words if you're looking for something in particular. So if you want to change the word, the, sorry, the, the language, say to Latin American Spanish, you can do that. And instantly the database changes. You can also translate. Go back to your favorites, words that you've selected throughout the application that you can then access via uh, the, the favorite system quite easily. And here's an info page, Collins. OK. And then uh, another application we'll look at is um, a game application. So this is non-branded, but this is one of our partners who have created a game called Quarrel using the Collins Scrabble Dictionary as the game database. 
So this is a game where you can play with friends um, via uh, the game center on um, the iOS system. So the purpose of this is to challenge other players to create better words. So I need to make a three letter word. Unfortunately, I lost that match. <laughs> so this dictionary content comes up, it gives you the definition, and it tells you what an anagram of the word content was. Collins works with a number of online partners. Um, in particular, we work with dictionary.com, providing them English content and also Spanish dictionary material as well. So just to give you an example of how this works, let's type in a word. We'll try obsequious. Yeah, and we provide um, a definition, but also um, etymology and information about the word. And so this is our, our biggest Spanish dictionary title, the uh, Collins Spanish Complete and Unabridged. And this was developed by a company called Cole Zoo. So this features the entire dictionary, and um, it has an interesting search function where you can type in any word. And look up all the words, all the words and um, definitions and sentences and examples associated with it. Rain. So you can also look up the conjugation. You can also click on any phrase or word and be instantly taken to that entry. Bye. You can easily switch the input language by clicking on these buttons near the search bar. And this app includes both English and Spanish um, audio. You can take a quick look at your bookmarks or your history. So you can keep track of all the words that you've looked at and instantly access anything. T-bone steak. <laughs>